Now it's time for more of Southern California's sports fishing voice. Let's talk hook up. Get ready for more of the best fishing information and the hottest tips on improving your angling skills. Let's Talk Hook Up is sponsored in part by Yamaha Outboards. Reliability starts here. Ford, the official truck of Let's Talk Hook Up. Shimano Rods and Reels. Fish with the best. Shimano. And by Rancho Leonero, where your wildest Baja dreams come true. And now, Southern California's sports fishing voice, the hosts of Let's Talk Hook Up, Pete Gray and Rock God Rick Maxa. Welcome back. Hour number two. Let's talk hook up on the Mighty 1090. Pete Gray here with Rock God Rick Maxa. Our final show of 2016. Ready for another year. 2017 coming up tomorrow. Carl Schmidt from Fisherman's Landing. The man who knows it all is here with I'll us back today. I'll back to you on that, man. No yeah, doubt. For sure. Yeah, Having a great back. time. And giving away a great prize. You're not kidding, man. We're giving away a fantastic prize. And again, thanks so much to Maui, Jim. You didn't catch the beginning of the show once a month, or once a week for the entire month of December, a pair of Maui Gyms giveaway, culminating with this awesome pair of glasses, the Red Sands. A really nice fisherman style of glasses. I really, really like the Red Sands. It's got a matte black frame with the brand new blue Hawaii lens, which has that blue mirror coating. It's really easy on the eyes, and that famous Maui Gym polarization. There's just not a better pair of glasses on the water than those Maui Gyms. And one lucky caller is getting those Red Sands at the end of the show today. If you want to get your chance at winning those great glasses, there's two ways you can be a part to let's talk hook up you want to call talk to carl have a question about fisherman's landing have a question about tackle boats or you want to tell us your highlight from 2016 we would love to hear from you this morning and if you do want to join us 858 area code 457 1090 that's the best way to get through it's got an open line 858 457 1090 you can also try us on our toll free number that one's totally full right now but there's going to be shots to get you through on that again that one is 877 877- 792-1090. Again, 877-792-1090. Not only are we talking fishing, talking your phone calls, we've got to come in through with the catch report and find out what's biting out there right now. And today, our fishdope.com report is sponsored in part by Fisherman's Processing in San Diego. Fisherman's Processing is San Diego's finest, and that's why they're known as the fish pros. Once you try them, you'll be hooked. They'll fillet and vacuum pack your fish all to your specs, as well as offer the best in smoked fish, jerky, and their famous tuna burgers. Check Fisherman'sProcessing.com for more details, or you can see them when your trip returns to the San Diego landings. Let's start it off with the guy who's done an awesome job, FishDope.com, reporting all year long. That's our private boater buddy, Captain Mark Wish. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, Pete and Carl. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing, Mark? Well, guys, we got the last report of the year on the last day of 2016. Man, what a year this has been. Unbelievable. <laughs> no yeah, doubt. Man, no doubt. It's, you know, and the setup is is looking good to roll right into that winter spring fishing of 2017. We got lots going on already here. Let me start up north. Uh, quite a bit of squid showing up around that uh, up above the Point Doom area, county line in there like that. Best volume of the squid is there. There's also been a sprinkle of sea bass on it. Not a lot, but some. Uh, good grade. And then. Um, also, a little bit farther down there, there's been some squish off of uh, Malibu. They're a good spot right there off of LAX underneath the airplanes taken off, a little bit off uh, Venice also. So, you know, the likelihood some fish will show up on that, but a lot of times, guys, if you make your bait there and then relocate to some of those kelp lines, like from Flat Rock down to Rocky proper or on some of that deep water hard bottom outside of Rocky proper, uh, this one, a 50-pounder, showed up this time last year, and uh, it's a standard thing for him to do that. So keep an eye on that sector there. Offshore, all the islands have been looked at this week, been some good codding, but uh, as of midnight tonight, that is over. No more cods here for a couple months till March 1st, sculpin only, guys. And uh, make sure you get your fishing licenses, by the way. And then uh, at Catalina, there's squid in a couple areas. Still some in the isthmus around the front there, around the back, a little dab in Silver Canyon. There's also a little dab off of Ben Weston's, been there for months on end. Uh, Bodes well for our yellows and sea bass fishing on the bait grounds. There's also been a little bit of big yellow on that deep water structure outside West Cove there, backside West End at San Clemente Island. Uh, good calico bass fishing on the plastic up in the shallow water. A couple guys checking that out there, very good fishing. And then uh, a little bit of that deep water yellowtail from the Nine down to the dunes there, backside west, uh, some of that hanging around. And then on the tuna grounds, probably our uh, last report here for 2016. My friend Rick that runs Oceanside 95 made their last day and a half out there. They fished up there yesterday. Uh, no signal on the bluefin, uh, but some nice yellows off the Cortez. 
One of my buddies sent me some pictures from the trip there. Absolutely flat calm. I mean, not a ripple. It's crazy how calm it was. But um, that looks like it's about over in terms of that tuna fish for now, although who knows? You know, there was some fish January of uh, this year and in 2015 also, so we'll just have to see. But uh, this year is over. We're looking forward to next year. Hope everybody has a happy and safe New, new Year's, and uh, good luck and good fishing, guys. Yeah, man. What a hey, year. What, what a, a year. year. And uh, a year. I, I think, I don't know, Mark, sea bass is this next uh, spring is going to happen? Oh, hell yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I like yeah, there's no, you know, right. we're going back to normal like you guys were talking at the start of the show there. You know, water temps are kind of going back to normal. The patterns are going back. The bait's showing up where it's supposed to be and when it's supposed to be. Uh, yeah, so I think we're going to see a little more traditional winter spring fishing and um you know that that's not bothering me too much i love fishing. <laughs> i think i just fine <laughs> man all right mark well you know fishdope.com you buy it today this is the crazy thing about fish dope you buy it today it's good till next new year's yeah. right nothing, nothing wrong with that 169 bucks for the entire year 20 bucks off for a new membership using the code hookup now Lowercase, no space, you get it for 149 bucks for the entire year. And you know exactly what's going on no all over the place. It's no brainer. Yep. You don't have it. Yeah. You better get it. And if we want to find you, how do we find you, Mark? Pete, we're in Huntington Beach on the corner of Bolts Cheek and Editor by the big Chevron station. Phone number is 714-840-4262. The website is PacificEdgeTackle.com. And since we are... The official fish dope reporters here. I do want to give a shout out to the main fish dope guy, my good friend Danny, who oh, yeah. really, really, really works hard. And and he's so tired and worn out. You know, when we're all celebrating New Year's Eve, he's gonna be sitting on a plane going back to Florida where they're gonna take a little vacation time. No, uh, right on, Danny. Well have fun. Deserved. Danny, I hope you're listening, buddy. You well deserved. deserved. Yeah, Danny is an amazing guy and he stays on that stuff like nobody else. Think about how many fish that guy has put people on throughout oh, yeah. the year. You know, it's myself and myself very much included. Yeah, no doubt of me too, for sure. Hey, happy New Year, Danny. Happy New Year, Mark. Wish, and we'll talk to you next year. You got it, buddy. Take next care time. and uh, Mark. be safe, everybody. We'll see you. All right, you too. Thanks All right, so let's continue with our catch port. Head on down to San Diego, over to Sea Fourth Sport Fishing, and talk to our buddy Marcos. Marcos, what's going on at Sea Fourth? Good morning, guys. How you doing today? Good morning. Great. Good morning. <clears throat> well. If yesterday afternoon's uh, half ditch was an indication, the fish might be cooperating with us. Like you just heard there, and we've known for a while now, tomorrow the uh, most of that bottom fish closes. But the new Sea Force went out yesterday afternoon and caught seven yellowtail on their half day. That's awesome. And, I saw that. That's yeah, awesome. definitely. Some bigger fish, too, 20, 30 pound fish. And RJ said that they lost quite a few of them. Nobody was really prepared for 20, 30 pound yellowtail on half day there. But they're going to be back out this afternoon taking a look at that and running. and. Hopefully that transitions into a nice alternative for January, February there. See some yellowtail, maybe some sand bass, maybe some other bass mixed in there. We're going to have some limited options, but there's still some definitely some good fishing in January, February there. So check the website for the half-day trips, seaforthlanding.com. The San Diego will be online at some point there. Hopefully by February they'll be up and running, but we don't have an ETA for them quite yet. And then if you want to do a little longer trip, head down the coast there, do maybe a freezer filler, catch some yellowtail, maybe get into some of that bottom fish. The Tribute is going to be running some day and a half trips through January, February, leaving Friday nights, coming back Sunday mornings. So definitely check that out, seaforthlanding.com. Full schedule is up there for those half days, the three-quarter days when we get them back online, those day and a half. You can make your reservations directly online there. You can always give us a call at the office, 619-224-3383. Or if you're feeling adventurous, come down and visit us here. Say hi. I love it, man. Right. Certainly no reason not to go by. Come hang out in the tackle store, get a breakfast burrito at the landing grill next door, yeah. and not, hang not out. Just, not just any breakfast burrito, though. Don't the Rock Rick breakfast Rock burrito. We can't. We can't. Holler. Yeah, don't, don't, don't sell yourself so <laughs> short there. <laughs> no Sounds like a good time to go do it, Marcos. Well, glad to hear that there was such good fishing and cool to hear that the exotics are coming. And with that closure, you know that those new Seaforth boys will be targeting those big yellows. So great info, Marcos. One more time, shoot us a phone number if somebody wants to call you and book a spot. Seaforthlanding.com. Give us a call at 619-224-3383, and we'll get you out there fishing. And, Marcos, thank you for no a doubt. great job, 2016, once again, and looking forward to another full year hanging out with Marcos on the radio. Absolutely. <laughs> we'll talk to you guys next <laughs> Thanks, Marcos. Thanks, Marcos. See you next year. That.
Hey, that's going to wrap up our catch report for now. And again, in sponsored part by Gamakatsu Hooks, Japan's leading fish hook that sets the standard for quality and innovation. Gamakatsu live bait hooks are designed to help keep your bait alive with a perfect bend so the bait swims harder and lasts longer. And it helps you get bit. They also come in a super strong, solid one-piece ring. You can get those Gamakatsu live bait hooks at your favorite tackle store. Indeed, and we normally we have Rick Jensen from Sport Fishing Financial. He's down in Baja doing a little field research out there so good luck rick and uh uh sport fishing financial great guy and uh rick is a is an awesome guy to have on your team and our team too and we want to thank rick for his support and everything he's done with the great reports and supporting our uh listeners out there for sure Not about that all right eight five eight four five seven ten ninety you want to have a chance to win that Ma- pair of maui gym sunglasses talk to carl there's your chance dan and encinitas you're up next on let's talk hook up good morning dan Hey, good morning, guys. Thanks for taking my call. Happy New Year. Got a bit of a cold, so I'll, I'll work my way through it. I got a my moment of the year and a question for Carl. The uh, question is, that, you know, I've watched the show go on TV for years, and I got my trip booked in March, so day and a half years, and just to get on the boat. What should I expect on that trip, and how was, how was the bunk set up? And uh, my, uh, my moment of the year was... Uh, Watching my dad pull with his Jigmaster 500, you know, all day, or not all day, but for like 40 minutes to and then get the fish to color and some black sea bass and we just let it go. So, <laughs> thanks. That's a cool fish and a cool story. So what's the guy going to expect on a day and a half on the Shogun in March this year, Carl? March, I'm going to suspect you're going to be fishing the Mexican coast, uh, probably the Colonnette area, uh, the yellowtail, lean cod, rockfish. Uh, if that bluefin's around you, Poke your nose out there if the weather's good and go maybe try to catch some uh, bluefin also. That's what I would be guessing. Uh, Bunk-wise, I believe all the – I mean, the Shogun is all state rooms. I think they're two- to three-man state rooms. You just call uh, Jen there in the office, and they'll take care of you for that. But, I mean, the Shogun's just an awesome fishing platform. So it is. Yeah. And the it, crew. Yeah, Aaron, Aaron and, and Russ, Russ and all those just, guys do a great job. And the chefs are great. I yeah. Mean, yeah. Kenny, I really like that Kenny's just an awesome chef, yeah. period. Yeah. And I've known Kenny for quite a while, and he's had no formal training. That's all parents and mom and taught him how to cook in wow. his own. That's wow. and, he's and that an amazing platform cook. is an amazing. Yeah, thing. yeah. It's been really fun getting to watch that boat and crew become what it did over the last few years. You know, with Aaron, Aaron, you know, acquiring his his part of the boat and operation, and then and then Russ, you know, becoming the number two guy, and then you know, watching that crazy good Guadalupe and how well those guys did and. And, I mean, we would see it at the tackle store, at least, and I'm sure Carl in the landing the same, like just trip after trip, people coming up and raving about, oh, I had such a good time. You wouldn't believe it. They did this and they did that. And, I mean, the the response from passengers was so high on the boat. It was really cool to watch, it, you know, the crew and captain and new owners of the boat and, you know, watch everything start clicking. And now it's just a showgun is just as yeah. premier of a fishing boat as they come. And Not- young crew, young captains. I mean, I felt really old. Well, I am old, but... Uh, <laughs> I, we, I was fishing with Russ on that six-day Let's Talk hookup trip, and Russ was like, oh, yeah, I'm turning 30. He's like, oh, oh really? <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm twice your age. Well, plus, <laughs> I think that's what's what's made them a top long-range boat again. Is they, they're a young crew, but they've been together now for yes. three or four years. And they just – it's just like anything. When you've been click. together, you the right click. Word. Yeah. And no one has to tell each other what to do or how to do something. Everyone just knows, and it just flows really, really yeah. well. No doubt about it. Now, speaking of the Shogun, Code Group is giving away a three-day trip on the Shogun, right? Correct. Uh, I believe Give that, us the details on that. that. Yeah. I don't have all the details. That's probably my bad there. But I, with the new launch of Michael Folk's – uh, and Fisherman's Landing coming together with the new website and new reservations program. Yeah, the code group's handling so, that whole thing for you now. Correct. Right? And as to get more people into it and getting them driving it to the uh, website and everything, they are going to be giving away a three-day trip on the Shogun. I believe it's going to be in March. It's going to be one of those uh, freezer special type wow. of trips. Awesome. Super popular. I mean, they would, sh- would sell out anyway. So yeah, very yeah. easy. And it's in March there. And it's going to be fishing the same type of deal. But, I mean, it, it's one of those trips where you don't know what you're going to run into. It's right kind of in the crossover area where you stick your nose out, find some bluefin, maybe an albacore. Who knows? I'm thinking we might get some there. Yeah. And uh, okay. it's just a I'm great way that. to kind of get the, the code group up and running. And no purchase it. necessary. No purchase. Yeah, so All what, you what do we got to do? 
go on the code group there. You go to our Fisherman's Landing website. Click on the little banner there. You will see it pop up there. Okay. Click on there. Give them your email address. Just go to fishermanslanding.com, and you'll see the code group banner. Yep. Click on Tell that. Them. It says win a trip, three-day trip on the Shogun. Put your email address in there. You're good to go. So I literally just did it. There's, um, I mean, you can't miss it. Yeah, as soon as you it. get on the front page, there's, there's, there's like two or three very big photos that kind of, you know, rotate, and it's the middle one of them, and it just says win a three-day trip aboard the Shogun, and you literally, you just click right on the, you know, it says click here, you know, right on the phone, and, you know, you see the code group logo, one click, and it takes you right to it. Yeah. So no. Enter your email, download cool. the app, and the cool thing about that app is if you're in the you want certain fish counts for certain boats and stuff, you could click on, I believe, whatever boats are in the code group, and you could get daily updates from that or when they post something on Facebook or something like you that. Customize you customize get... it for yourself. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. All right. Very good. Hey, Dan, Happy New Year. Thanks a lot for the phone call this morning. Speaking of it, being a new year, you need a new calendar. It is calendar right? time. And, you know, we talked about this when Bill was here, Bill Varney's new sport fishing tide calendar. It's got all the tides, you know, and it's it's kind of like he took, what uh, the great job that Bill Record did for so many years and took the calendar over with, with exceptional photos and yeah, two, two in particular. I mean, there's, yeah, there's two, two that really, really stand yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. December and, and July. July. I mean, yeah, let's yeah. let's be real yeah. about it. So, <laughs> Just they so, look so good. But over really every photo was great. Yeah, he did and an awesome job. He did a job. really great job on the calendar. So and I love and, the mix of photography too. There's you know there's surf fishing, there's long range fishing, there's exotic fishing, yeah. there's local fishing, and it's really 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 well done and has that killer tide chart. And you can win a prize. I like that. You know, benefiting CCA California uh, every I, I, at least every week or every every month or I'm not I forget that every other week maybe uh, we're gonna draw a number which is on the back of the calendar. Like my number is three four nine one. And uh, if you see on the Facebook page that number posted or you hear it here on Let's Talk Hookup posted, you're going to win a great prize. That's so cool. it's all to benefit CCA California. So good job there, Bill. Get your sport fishing calendar. I know you have them at Fisherman's Absolutely. Landing Absolutely. sold a ton of them already and yeah. continue to do so. Yeah, and uh, they have them at various tackle stores up and down the coast. Get that sport fishing calendar. The, it's really a great, great job. So all of you know Uncle Roy and Cousin Darren and all of the fishing people in the you know in the extended family for Christmas time last year when Bill um, you know no longer chose to do the calendar and there wasn't one. Everybody, well, I mean, they looked at you like, where's, where's, where's my calendar? calendar? Like, this is an every year tradition, and I'm, yeah. you know, where, where's my calendar? And so this year, thanks to Bill Varney putting, doing such an awesome job, every one of the fishing guys in the extended Maxa family got another calendar. Okay, that's back to normal, you know. Right. Like, it was, we're good now. There's some serious bay bass discussion that always happens. Oh, oh yeah. Our Christmas is the same every time. Everybody opens up the gifts, and and all of the fishing people always get one of those from from Dad and I, and uh, and instantly we all start flipping around. Okay, well, what's the tide like in the Bay Bass tournament? We start BSing about pre-fishing days and all the fun stuff there. Oh so, yeah, big deal. It's a big deal. It's coming up three weeks, right? Yeah, now. yeah, January twenty first today. Whew, that's crazy. Oh, crazy. watch I'm out! Start, start getting ready. Watch out, Rock Eight five eight four five seven ten ninety open right now. You want to get through? There's your chance. Don and Woodland Hills, you're up next on Let's Talk Hookup. Good morning, Don. Hey guys, good morning and happy New Year to all of you. Happy New Year, um, man. Twenty sixteen, what a year! What a year! Awesome. Um, hard to pick a particular memory. So I think I'm just going to leave it at I met a lot of old friends fishing, made a lot of new friends fishing, and just had a great time out of San Diego on some really outstanding boats. So just thanks to everybody for that. And then looking forward to 2017. And, you know, you mentioned it there on the calendar, CCA, that's our future. We all had a great year. We want to have better years looking ahead. We need to support CCA so we can go fishing and fish in places we still can fish now. You bet, man. Well said. It's uh, really well done. And, Don, Happy New Year to you. Thanks a lot for the call this morning. All right. Sam in Irvine, you're up next on Let's Talk Hookup. Sam, thanks for hanging in there with us. <laughs> Good morning and uh, Happy New Year to you all. It's been a great year. Um, I just wanted to uh, share that I finally got a big bloop in this year I, at the uh, Tanner Bank right in November, I had been, you know, a yellowtail fishing and got, you know, all kinds of good fishing, but it was always in the back of my mind, and uh, I had never really hooked a fish in the 100-pound category, and, uh, you know, I lost a couple on 60, but they, uh, I went out on that 095 at the end of the season, and, and they got 
49 bluefin for that night. Wow. We actually got them late into the night, but, uh, wow. you know, I had never really pulled on 80 pound line with uh, heavy fish and it was pretty awesome. So. <laughs> That's so cool, Sam. How, how big was your big one? It was r- right at 100 pounds. Sweet. It's close enough to 100 pounds where I'm calling it a Heck 100. Yeah, I man. I got two of them. And how'd yeah, you catch them? Off, but, oh, you know, everybody was using those sliding sinkers, but I had gone on, uh, you know, they were catching them kind of deep, but they were down about two, 200 feet, 240. I think I hooked mine all down on the bottom. Um, and I put a, a, a torpedo sinker. I couldn't get bit. You know, everybody's using those glow sliding sinkers. But, um, and I tried those the ones that get bit and got in tangles. I had lost like two in tangles on 60 pounds. So then I, I dropped down deep to get away from everybody and I, I rubber banded on like, uh, you know, get, get that where you put the band, the loop through actually the top hole and then the bottom hole sure. and put the hook through the loop so it holds it tight. Mm-hmm. And then I, I got them down on, uh, at, at, at the bottom. So I actually had to haul them up from the bottom, uh, which was a long, long battle, but it was, it was really awesome. But yeah, I was down on the bottom at like, I think I landed my last one at, uh, 11 o'clock at night. Wow. Neat. What, what a, a great trip. story. Very Sam, cool. congratulations and happy new year. Thanks a lot for the call. Hey, when we come back, we got more of your phone calls, more stories, more great times. And if you want to be a part of the show, 858 457 1090. It's open right now. We got more Let's Talk Hookup coming your way on the Mighty 1090. Rock Cod Rick here for West Coast Marine and Parker Boats. You see them all over Southern California waters. Parker Boats at the launch ramp, the offshore islands. You wake up in the morning on an overnight trip, and there they are. Parker Boats of all size fishing in the same area as the sporties. There's a good reason for it, fishability and seaworthiness. Of all the boats out there, my boat partner and I chose to get a brand new 25 Parker Center Console from Kevin Kelly and the gang at West Coast Marine, and I could not be happier. Wow, what a fishing machine. Parker Marine builds a heavy-duty, industrial-strength boat probably overbuilt but that's why so many four and six pack charters choose to operate parkers we thank the guys at pinnacle sport fishing season sport fishing one man charters black and blue sport fishing for their confidence in parker boats take it from me if you are ready for a new parker at a fair upfront and honest deal you need to see kevin kelly at west coast marine located at 1555 newport boulevard in costa mesa or check out their inventory and information at westcoastmarine.com Time to talk about great gear on from Shimano, and you're talking about uh, getting a boat from West Coast Marine. You equip it with the best, and that's Shimano gear Out, man. on that. And that Bay Bass Tournament coming up, you're going to be fishing the Parker. Uh, what's the reel of choice? Calcutta 400D. The Ooh, Calcutta nice. D series is, is the one for us. Mega line capacity. Okay. We're, we're, we're long line guys. You know, we, we like to let a lot of line off the reel, let that line settle to the bottom. Wind our swim bait across the bottom, you know, keeping it in the strike zone when we're fishing the edge of the channel for sand bass. And line capacity is a big deal, especially when you got a lot of tide moving or you got a lot of wind. Um, paying a lot of line out, having line capacity is a huge deal. And that new Calcutta 400D holds the same amount that your old Calcutta did, but in a much skinnier frame. It's shorter and taller. It has a bigger spool to frame ratio, so it fits in your hand really nice, but still has power and gearing to deal with a big fish when you got a lot of line off the reel. I absolutely love it. Yeah, it is. And I love that small star drag on it, too. It doesn't get in the way. It's outside sweet. of the handle. Outside. It's so cool. Check it out, the Calcutta D from Shimano at your local Shimano dealer. If the fish are biting, I'm on my boat, rain or shine. Of course, I wear my life jacket. It's like wearing a seatbelt. Clip it on, grab my tackle box, and hit the water. Love California, boat California, save California. A message from California State Parks Division of Boating and Waterways. Imagine being home in the morning and fishing yellowtail and calicos at Cedros Island by the afternoon. Now you can with Cedros Adventures. Experience world-class yellowtail and calico fishing aboard comfortable pongas with local captains that know the island hotspots. Stay in Cedros Adventures' own private waterfront hotel and experience first-class meals and service with pickups in LA, Orange, or San Diego County. You hop aboard a scheduled flight to Cedros Island to begin an incredible experience. Trips are all inclusive and offer old world hospitality and fantastic fishing. Cedros Adventures. Call 310-435-6353 or check CedrosAdventures.com for rates and more information. Alaska's Katmai Lodge is a world-class wilderness fishing paradise on the banks of the famed Alagnac River. You'll fish for all five species of Pacific salmon, king, sockeye, chum, coho, and on even years.
Tigers Pinks, plus trophy-sized rainbow trout, Arctic Grayling, and Dolly Varden, both in the Alagnac and the nearby waters. Katmai Lodge's U.S. Coast Guard and CPR certified guides are fish and fanatics and know how to help you reel them in. They are exceptional teachers and ensure you have days that are fish-filled and fun with freshly prepared snacks and barbecued lunches on the river. Back at the lodge, there are fireside appetizers and refreshments each afternoon, as well as fresh, delicious meals prepared by their exceptional chef. Elevate your visit with a quick fly-out trip to Brooks Falls in Katmai National Park for world-renowned bear watching. For the best fishing adventure ever, visit katmai.com. That's K-A-T-M-A-I.com. Are you feeling that itch to get out on the water? Come fishing on the American Angler and reacquaint yourself with some familiar faces and make new friends. Captain owners Brian Kiyohara and Sam Patella take pride in every aspect of the American Angler operation, from their loyal and trusted crew to the sashimi-grade fresh fish you'll take home. It's easy to find a vacation that fits your schedule. We have everything from day and a half to 10-day trips and longer. Call me at the office, 619-223-5414, or check us out at AmericanAnglersportFishing.com. We want you to become a part of the American Angler family. XRPRS 1090 AM Rosarito, Baja California. The best NFL coverage is right here. San Diego sports leader, the mighty 1090. Welcome back to Let's Talk Hookup on the mighty 1090. All right, you want to get through? Here's your chance. One line open, 858-457-1090 open right now. Hey, we got our good friend Mary Francella from Poway Valley Collision on the line. Good morning, Mary. Hi, Mary. Good, good morning, guys. How are you? Hey, we're awesome. doing great. Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year to both of Actually, all three of you guys. Hi, yeah, Mary. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. You know, Poway Valley Collision does great work. We've been very proud to represent them and support uh, such a great uh, group that does so much great work. But today, you're into something else today, and it's called Innovative Nutrition, right? Yes, it is. Yeah. It is. Tell, tell us about yeah. that. It is a health and nutrition company. We figure, you know, it's coming up into a new year. People have their New Year's resolutions of always getting healthy, eating better, exercising. So what a better way to start this. Yeah. We do. It's all natural products that we have. Um, we're a new company. We started in October. We've got a little over 750 customers in two and a half months. Wow. Jeez. But what we do is... It's health and nutrition. You can have things to help you get a better night's sleep, more restful. It helps with people with anxiety and stress. There's a liquid vitamin that we have that your body will absorb approximately 98% of the vitamin. It has glucosamine in it. Wow, that's have good product. for old guys like me with joint problems, right? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. It helps. You should see Jim is Young guys like phenomenal me. on this. And Rick? Even young guys, huh? I'm in it, man. I love it. That's cool. <laughs> but there's one in particular that I love. It's called a success spray. You spray this under your tongue three to four times a day, but it has an appetite suppressant in it. It helps with your mood, your energy. It keeps you focused. But you lose so much weight on this. You feel Ooh. better. Wow. I follow a ketogenic eating plan. What plan can you lose weight and still eat Eggs, bacon, avocado, cheese for breakfast. Man, yeah, that's awesome. I, well, it's, I, I know Mary was a huge key to success, and you know, and, and I, I lost a bunch of weight, you know, following a, a plan that Mary put together for me. And like I said, I can personally say that you know everything she did was awesome and easy to follow, and I'm I'm just all about it. And this is something new, and I, I put a lot of trust into her for sure. You know, she she was awesome in, in helping me, so I'm, I'm I would I would be all over the you know. If, it's got her stamp of approval. I'm, I'm all about it. Well, thank you for that. You know, what we're doing is January 14th, it's a Saturday at 10 a.m., we're having a launch party for California. The owner and CEO of Innovative Nutrition, her name is Heidi Whitehair. She's coming into town, and we're putting together this event, get as many people there as we can to introduce the products to them. I'm going to have samples there. I'm going to have um, a raffle. I'll be raffling off some of our products. I also have a half-day fishing trip and a three-quarter-day three fishing trip I'm going to raffle off. Yeah, and so, also some other stuff that we're going to we're going to give you, too, to give away. So uh, right, you're going to have right. swag to nice. give away for just, I for, will. just for showing up. Swag's always to, a good thing. To learn to be healthy it, yep. and lose weight. And, it, wow. 
That's a it's deep. amazing. And the way you feel is absolutely phenomenal. The one other thing that we have, it's an energy drink. It helps you with your energy. It helps to focus your clarity. And the products, like I said, are just unbelievable. The taste is phenomenal. So, so how do you go to, to this event? It's on the 14th, Saturday the 14th, two weeks from today. Correct. And how do we, where is it going to be and how do we go there? It's at the Hampton Inn and Suites in Poway up on Stowe Drive. Okay. You can give me a call. I can get you registered. You can look me up on Facebook, and you can register that way as well. So phone number for me is 858-518-3190. You can also find me on Facebook under Mary Francella, and I have it on there. The invite is on there. You can register on or just show up Saturday the 14th at 10 a.m. at the Hampton Inn and Suites in Poway. In Poway. All right. But, uh, and again, uh, Facebook, Mary Francella. Yes. Or what's your phone number once again? 858-518-3190. All right. Sounds like a no-brainer to me. Right. Win some free, free swag and uh, learn to take better care of yourself in 2017. Exactly. With innovative nice. nutrition, Mary Francella. Thanks, Mary. You guys, thank you so much. I look forward to helping everybody, and we'll see you then. Thanks, All right. Mary. Thanks, Mary. All right. Appreciate Have that. a good day, guys, and right. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, for mm-hmm. sure. Bye-bye. Hey, Jeff from Sedros Tackles on the line. Good morning, Jeff. Hey, good morning, you guys. How's it going? What's up, Jeff? Happy, uh, Happy, Happy New, New Year. Year. Yeah, you too, buddy. I uh, just wanted to say, Pete, um, your support of what I've been doing uh, the past couple of years, so genuine. Um, super, super appreciate it. We had a, a, just a great opening year for Sedros Tackle and Sedros Kayak Fishing and having you come down and Ron Lane and all the guys from Hobie. It's just, uh, it's been so exciting. Um, you're just, you're such a warm heart and you've, uh, just open arms supported me from the start. So just wanted to call in and say thank you so much and looking forward to 2017 for sure that's very nice of you jeff and same goes back at you you're such a great guy you've put your heart and soul into this operation that sedro sedro's kayak fishing sedro's tackle and it shows because it's such an awesome awesome experience and now 2017 the trips our first trip is already sold out you had to add a second trip uh to go there it's 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 Sedros in a totally different world when you hang yeah, out with yeah. Jeff. Yeah, it, it really is. Uh, you know, we're we're fortunate. Uh, a lot of the guys that came down already uh, this year. Um, I've got trips as early as March already planned for wow. some of that halibut and stuff along the shore. So, just you know, super super exciting. Um, we caught so many different species last year out of those kayaks, uh, those Hobie Mirage drives, and now with uh, Hobie uh, hooking us up with that 180 reverse drive. Um, wow, it's just, you know, changes. just really, really looking forward to next year and getting everyone out there. I'd have to say uh, my highlight for the year, um, I did get one good uh, bluefin to, to 71 pounds, but uh, definitely that uh, that giant broomtail grouper, that world record grouper that I caught down there on the kayaks. Yeah. No, um, yeah. How big was that? Definitely, definitely my, my year maker. What was that? How big was that, Jeff? 108.9. Oh, uh, so we got the all tackle. A uh, world record for that one, and they also just gave me the 80-pound line class for that same fish. So uh, right. on, the, on a Hobie kayak? Off the Hobie Pro Angler 14, and I was glad I was in the bigger boat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bet you were, Jeff. What a cool fish, man. That's awesome. And I want yeah. to throw out a uh, big thank you for the support that Ron Lane and the guys at Fast Lane have thrown out to you and, and, and our support of, of you and everything without Ron, I mean, i sure you agree. It, it, he's certainly a big part of the team for sure. Oh, 100, 110 percent. Uh, he, he's helping me with, you know, advertising, all kinds of things now. He, he came down three times this past year, and uh, we've already got three trips with him planned for next year. So just, uh, yeah, super, super great guy. Uh, you hooked me up with him from the start, and that's where I got the boats. And he continues to support us and, and push this forward. And uh, I'm looking forward to hanging out with him on January 14th. He's got that uh, thing going down there at Dana Landing. So I'm That's definitely right. going to be down there cool. talking to everybody. So, um, yeah, again, Happy New Year to all you guys. Thank you so much. And looking forward to 2017. So, you will, yeah, we'll be broadcasting live at Dana Landing. It's the bay, the pre-Bay Bass Seminar and Sale at Dana Landing. And then they'll be doing the, the uh, seminar over at Fast Lane uh, with all the top bay bass experts and so you'll be down there with sejo's kayak uh, adventures too huh yeah absolutely we'll we're uh, going to be hanging out down there and uh 
try to uh, talk to the boys and see if uh, what new baits they got coming up and uh, get some get some testing going on down at the island. Fantastic the stuff. Looking happy, forward to it. Happy New Year, Jeff, and uh, thank you for your support. Guys. And we'll look forward to a great 2017. Absolutely. See you then. All right, for sure. Let's go ahead and jump into those jam-packed phones, Rick. You got it, man. How about this time we talk to Doug, who's calling us from Montebello this morning. Good morning, Doug. Welcome to Let's Talk Hookup. Yeah, i got a question for Pete only. Uh, how did you come up with this idea of the Let's Talk Hookup show? How much hassle would you have getting it on the uh, show anyway? And who's your first sponsor? <laughs> that's, a, that's a good question. It's probably been told too many times, but I'll tell it again. 25, plus, 25 and a half years ago... I was working for a radio station up in Carlsbad uh, as a sales manager and started Let's Talk Hook Up on the side as something fun to do. It morphed into um, something a little more than a little fun thing to do. And uh, eventually I took a big gulp and quit my my really cushy good job, good paying, <laughs> great job. Safety. And, yeah, safety and uh, and uh, went full, full force into it. And... Uh, Fortunately, it was never a, never had to look back. Uh, Bill Poole was the first guest on the show, and uh, Fisherman's Landing and XL were the first uh, sponsors. On really, the show. very cool. I yeah, didn't know that. so yeah, so they were the first guys to really step up. And in fact, the whole Long Range Fleet, or most of the Long Range Fleet, were really the guys that really put us on the map. The the landings in San Diego, C4 Sport Fishing. Um, those guys were really the guys that came. And then you know, one by one, we became more notoriety and and started uh picking off some of the the bigger sponsors and and growing from that and and you know it's i feel very fortunate to be able to do something uh for that long that i love to do and it's a lot of hard work and a lot of efforts and then you know having marty milner and rock cod rick and and all the people that are associated with let's talk hookup it's it's a dream come true and i'm lucky to live the dream that's, that's all right. i can tell that's you good story great. man that's awesome yeah thank you very much doug happy new year to you all right let's jump back into the phones this time we're going to talk to robert call us from capistrano beach good morning robert welcome to let's talk hookup hi robert hey good morning gentlemen and happy new year um uh, you know what i've got a a question for carl for fisherman's landing and a question for Rick as well. Um, Rick, what? First, I'll go to Rick. What were you throwing those poppers on? Uh, we what ha- were you using to throw those poppers? Were you using a spinning reel or? No, I was fishing. Oh, come on, with- <laughs> you should be using a spinning reel. <laughs> I was fishing with a Talica 12. That was uh that was really. I would say that we had two popper outfits that we used most of the time. If we could get some bit of an idea of the fish that we were after, if we felt the fish were a hundred pounds and below, we were fishing with a tranks, and if we felt the fish were larger than that, you know those one fifties to two hundreds, and we w- and then at least I was fishing with a Talica twelve. So those those are my my casting two reels. Casting a Talica twelve, which is pretty amazing lever drag casting reel. Yeah, I mean it, it, it. The tranks I think is the best conventional casting reel for a popper with braid there is. Period. And the Talica 12, in my opinion, for a reel that can handle a fish of big size, you know, tuna over 100 pounds, I think the Talica 12 is the best casting small two-speed there is, period. All right. Very good. Thanks a lot for the phone call this morning. All right. Uh, let's jump back into the phones. This time, talk to Mongo. Mongo, good morning. Welcome to Let's Talk Hookup. Mongo. Hey, hey. Happy New Year, guys. Happy New Year, Mongo. Mongo. Oh, man. I, my, I have a, a story I want to tell you, but I have, can I ask you a question first about Something not doing, dealing with fishing? Go ahead. I'm afraid. How about the Chargers? What's going to happen with the Chargers in San Diego? See you later. Well, I'm bye bye. back here a million miles away, and I'm my favorite team. I just wonder what's going to happen to them. Are All they right. going to stay there or not? See you later. Bye. What's your story, Mongo? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mine, mine was was it the first of the, uh, trip I went on was uh, fishing Cedros. And I, we went, uh, got off the plane, went down to the boat, and uh, we were going after Kelly's, and we, I brought my bass gear, 20-pound string, 8-foot rod, like a noodle, and they said, well, the Kelly's didn't show, so we went outside, and we were fishing for yellowtail, and actually I got bit, and that was an experience to catch a 36-6 on 20 on a little buggy whip rod it whipped my butt that's that's a good story hey mongo happy new year thanks a lot for the phone call this morning all right next up let's talk to mike who's calling us from rosemead this morning hey mike welcome to let's talk hookup good morning mike hey good morning 
in my highlight of the year was not catching the biggest fish I've ever caught or anything like that. It happens to be the smallest fish that we all can relate to, and that was an anchovy. I was surf fishing up here by uh, Bolsa Chica, Sunset Beach area, and I was looking south towards uh, Huntington Beach, and I saw thousands and thousands of these birds just diving and crashing into the surf line, and and uh, it was probably about a half a mile down the beach, and uh, it was slowly working its way up towards me, and I saw this black. I mean, this the sea was just black, 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 just this massive ball of anchovies just maybe 300 yards off the surf line, and, and it was just a phenomenal sight, and uh, it was just, it was just something to behold, and and uh, that was my highlight of the year. Actually, it was also oh, a, man. a lot of our highlights because that's a lot of the, what that big bluefin was on, mm, right? No doubt. You go out there, you see these big black spots, and all of a sudden they just would erupt, right? So cool. Yeah, and and while we're on that subject of bait, we want to throw out a big thank you to all the bait haulers up and down the coast, but especially the Everingham brothers in San Diego. Man, those guys. Just did it. And, Carl, you can relate because that's your life down there. I don't think people realize how important they are to Southern California sport fishing. Yeah. I mean, they are the the backbone of this business yeah. because the way we fish, if it wasn't for them, we would be just another East Coast type of fishery. Yeah. The Roll amount around. of how hard those guys work and the amount of hours they put in oh, is yeah. just amazing. Unbelievable. Yep. And, and all the way down, I mean, from the top. From guys flying planes to the guys working their butts off, you know, driving the boats, wrapping the bait, and then the crews that assist with that, and to the guys that are working their butts off at all hours of the day, you know, loading bait from the boats into the boxes, and then the guys that are on the barge that are scooping you bait, and everybody in between. I mean, think about all the mechanisms that have to be working right for that to happen, to find bait, haul it, catch it, keep it, store it, you know, get it to us. It's just such a... A crazy team, and those guys work so hard. And I know we always try to praise them, but I mean, they still are. They're the unsung yeah. heroes, man. No oh, doubt. Oh, for sure. Okay. And the, when we had that period where we just had anchovy, remember that? And sure. How, how challenging that was. And then they found the sardine again, and how it was like big cheers coming out. <laughs> and like that. But yeah, I, I'd say good call on that the year of the anchovy. And I think, you know, Carl, are we going to see more of that next year? Me personally, I hope so. Okay. Albacore, right? Albacore and. Uh, yeah, bread and butter right there. there you go. Good bass right. fishing. Yep. Bass yeah, fishing. all of it. And the kelp coming back oh, so strong. It's a good sign, I'm man. I tell you what, I searched a couple times this week, and the kelp is just back. That's it cool. is just back strong and That's strong. Good. I mean, it looks super healthy, and you know, spots that didn't have, haven't had kelp for two years are just loaded again. That's great news. Yeah. So yeah, watch out. Bass fishing. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Thanks a lot for the call this morning. Hills in Ventura, you're up next on Let's Talk or Hook Up. What's up, Hills? Hey, guys. How are you guys doing? Doing great. great. Good morning. Great. Morning. Um, hey, I want to ask Carl. Um, you know, I, I was I got to fish with Carl on the Malahini. It's been quite a few years ago, and, of course, he caught, and I, I kind of didn't. But he was real comfortable with the uh, jig stick. But, um so I wanted to ask if his brother's still running the Malahini. It was had really fun time. And then I, another thing uh, that um, Carl might answer is if if you don't have a passport and you want to go fishing, is there a way to to be able to get on a trip that doesn't require a passport out of the landing? Oh, absolutely. Right for the passport. The, right now, the only thing you need a passport for right now is the Coronado Island trips and the Colinette trips. During the summer. 99% of the time, you don't need a passport offshore. Or, offshore, correct. That's the key. If you're fishing, you want to go on a long range trip, you got to have a passport. Correct. So on your one day trips to your three day trips or some of your four day trips, you probably don't need a passport. Check the website and stuff like that. Uh, for my brother, he's not on the Malahini right now. He's in the refrigeration business, but I wouldn't be surprised. If he comes back. If he's back in the business sooner or later. Yeah. He's Can't just like away. me. Yeah, it's it's in our bloods. I mean, yeah. we've been doing this since we were both 9 and 10 years old. So Hills, happy new year to you. Thanks a lot for the phone call this morning. I'm going to throw one more thing out at there. It's 2017. Just do it. Just go get that passport. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, on, it's Hills. just because you don't really? want to, you don't, you just don't want to be stuck with, oh, I can only go on this trip or I can only go on that trip or I can only go at this time of year because they're fishing. Around. I mean, just, man, just do it. Like, everybody that's listening that hasn't got your passport, it's our fishing. It's what we all do. And and I promise you, it's not that big of a deal. It's just super just easy. go get it. So easy.
2017. Let's Last make it happen. 10 years. Exactly. Passport or passport card. Get them both. Yeah. Yeah. Agreed. All Agreed. Right. Brett in Winchester. Here next on Let's Talk Hookup. What's up, Brett? Welcome to the show. Howdy. Welcome. Uh, <laughs> Happy New Year, guys. You too, Brett. Happy New Year. So I've had my uh, two-speed reels for two, two years now, and uh, I've never got to put it in a lower gear. And uh, this year I went fishing um, through overnight boats and uh, didn't catch a single fish. But i got to use my uh, lower gear when i got to reel in uh, four uh, other people's lines just to get it in. It was so heavy. Hmm. But it did switch around towards the second half of the year. I ended up with uh, eight bluefins over 100. And 10 of them over 80, and you can throw in another four 60-pound yellowfish. Jeez, wow. Brad, nice job. Yeah. yeah. I, it was hooked. I, I was telling my wife I was going to buy a new freezer and uh, said, will you do that or buy another reel? And I said, I think I'll buy another reel. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, man. What a year. Congratulations. Yeah, great. All Hope right. We got another one coming. All right. Yeah, for sure. Thanks a lot for the call. Happy New Year to you. All right. Next up, let's talk to Rudy. Call us from Carlsbad. Hi, Rudy. Welcome to Let's Talk Hookup. Uh, good morning, gentlemen. And uh, Pete and Rick, thanks a lot for all the help you know you guys have given me. And what's the name of that glass, uh, you know, the lenses with the coating on them that you're using? Oh, now? the Blue Hawaii. Blue Hawaii. Yeah. They make, okay. You just, uh, if you go on the Maui Gym website and you just uh, search for Blue Hawaii, it'll give you all lens. I believe there's 10 styles now that you can get okay. with the Blue Hawaii lens. Yeah, and I got something done over the holidays, too. I, uh, I got my toe chopped off, so now I can, uh, you know, I, I got to get a special fitting, so I got my balance. But uh, I, I took care of the problem that kept popping up. There you go. <laughs> yeah, well, congratulations. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to you. Thanks a lot for the call. Robert in Capistrano Beach, just about 30 seconds left for you, Robert. Good morning, Robert. Hey, good morning, guys, and a happy new year. Um, I, I got in a little bit earlier, and I got one question answered by Rick. It's what he was throwing those poppers on. All right, you've already used 20 but, of your 30 seconds, so quick. Okay. Um, Carl, what was your best-selling reel of the whole year? Was it a Italica or... You know, what was what was it, Carl? I think the Talica 12 or 16 were probably the number one and number two selling reels for the bluefin, yellowfin. I mean, it's just an all-around Southern California yeah. reel. Maybe throw the tranks in there along with it. Yeah. Those, those three, like anything that was appropriate for catching big tuna this Funny year. Funny, they're all amazing. three Shimano's. <laughs> yeah, amazing the way that works, huh? Uh, they were good, man. We no doubt about nothing it. nothing but the best. Yeah. And I'm proud to say that we're... Back in gear with Shimano for 2017 here on Let's Talk Hookup. Sweet. So thank them for the support, and that's uh, it's all good. They make the best around. There's no question about that. Hey, appreciate the phone call. When we come back, we got more Let's Talk Hookup, including finding out who's winning those brand-new pair of Maui gyms. More Let's Talk Hookup coming your way on the Mighty 1090. For East Cape Fishing, Jen Rin is known as the best. This is Mark Rayer. Great service, top quality equipment, including all accurate reels, CalStar rods, and Cibran Electronics, has put my immaculately maintained twin engine cruisers in a class of their own. For memories of a lifetime, just bring your hat and sunglasses, and we'll provide a fishing experience that will exceed your expectations. Our calendar's filling fast, so don't miss out. For packages, two live webcams, a weekly fisher report, and more, check out TeamGenRin.com. We pick up at all East Cape Resorts. So let's go fishing. Turner's Outdoorsman, Southern California's number one shooting, hunting, and fishing tackle retailer since 1971, is right in your neighborhood. Now 18 stores throughout Southern California and three in San Diego County. Turner's Outdoorsman brings you the best prices and selection, plus a knowledgeable staff that will help make your day on the water or in the field more fun. Stop by your neighborhood, Turner's Outdoorsman. To find the location nearest you, check the web at turners.com and sign up for special deals and more. Everyone likes special treatment. You know, kind of feel like a VIP. Well, that's how our listeners are treated at Poway Valley Collision. I have personally heard of several stories of how well our friends Jim and Mary take care of their customers that we sent them. Poway Valley Collision is worth the drive from anywhere in the Southland. We know you may not need them today, but when accidents happen, it pays to go to Poway Valley Collision. And listen to this. Our listeners get a special discount that can save you hundreds of dollars on your car or truck repair. Just tell them you listen to the show and you get the deal. They work with most insurance companies, including Auto Club, 
MetLife, Wawanisa, and more. Just bring your car or truck to them and let Poway Valley Collision do the rest. I have had my truck repaired at Poway Valley Collision, and the job was perfect. So get your vehicle fixed right at Poway Valley Collision. Tell them you listen to Let's Talk Hookup, and they'll save you money on your repair. Poway Valley Collision, 14211 Garden Road in Poway. Check PowayValleyCollision.com. Fifth Avenue Insurance has a new name. It's Snap Insurance. Still providing anglers and boaters with the best in boat insurance and the lowest rates. The experts at Snap Insurance will make sure your boat and property are covered right. Traveling to Mexico? Snap has you covered. You can even work with your agent to wrap your home and auto with your boat policy to save even more. Call them for advice on your current boat policy or any of your insurance needs. Snap Insurance, 800-527-6617 or snapins.com. That's S-N-A-P-P-I-N-S. Com. No matter the fishing conditions, count on the Seaguar family of fluorocarbon leader material to help you catch more fish. Fluoro Premier has a smaller diameter with the highest break strength. Plus, it is super soft. When bites are tough, tie on Fluoro Premier. Blue Label is tough as nails with incredible abrasion resistance and impact strength. And new Pink Label is the choice for tough light conditions, giving you a little more visibility for better line control. Pick up a spool of Seaguar at your favorite Tackle Dealer or visit Seaguard.com. Welcome back to Let's Talk Hookup on the Mighty 1090. You're right, the big winner of the Red Sands Maui Gym Sunglasses with a brand new blue Hawaii lens is going to Dawn in Woodland Hills. Dawn, congratulations. You are going to love those new Maui gyms. Oh, yeah, and the new lens, awesome, awesome. Hey, Carl, Fisherman's yeah, Landing. Great job, Carl. He's a, Really a, a focal guy at Fisherman's Landing there, uh, one of the co-managers there at Fisherman's Landing. And uh, you, you have any questions about anything, you can call Carl and talk to him at Fisherman's Landing there. And also I want to remind people that uh, three-day trip on the Shogun versus through Code Group through Fisherman's Landing. Correct. Just go on the Fisherman's Landing website and fill out the there. information, email, download the app, and you're in there. It's super simple. Take you two minutes yeah and you can book everything online at fisherman's landing the whole deal correct yep yeah. and if you're going to get a charter and get charters in now they're filling up fast how do you do a charter you call you directly call us directly uh then we'll get a hold of the boat make sure they have open dates uh like i said i know some of the boats are already filling up fast the dawn pacific dawn the pegasus the fortune has got a few open dates uh any of the open party boats are always open for charter also I know some guys like the favorite uh, Condor and the Pacific Queen and the Prowler. They love those boats. Yeah. And they get however many people they want. Give us a call. We'll get you all set up. You do it all. Sooner the better, though. Yeah. Try What's the phone number? 619-221-8500 or Fishman'sLanding.com. All right. Thanks. Happy New Year Great to job, you, Carl, Carl, and the whole Happy crew down at Fisherman's Landing. And thank you very much. You, all you great supporters and listeners, all our sponsors out there for Let's Talk Hookup. Thanks to Ryan and Adam on the other side of the glass. Thanks to Rock God Rick, my good partner here. And happy 2017 to everybody. And we're going to celebrate it right next Saturday. No show tomorrow. Once again, no show New Year's Day. Uh, we're sleeping in. <laughs> and we should, too. So we're going to have a show next Saturday with Captain Brandon Hayward from One Man Charters and the Bite Journal. What a great way to start the year. And then next Sunday, Ollie and Jason from BD Outdoors and Fishdope.com. Uh, going to be a great show next weekend, next Saturday and Sunday. Happy New Year, everybody. Thanks again for the support. We'll see you next week right back here on the Mighty 1090.